What is up everyone, it's CMG here. Welcome to another Genshin Impact video. So it's been a while since I've done a Genshin Impact video. So today I want to do a quick video about uh, what I've been doing recently with this character here, Kokomi. And uh, also I'm just going to do a little bit of gameplay on some of the new event stuff for the 2.6 update. So uh, that's what I'm going to do. But first of all, I want to show you what I've done with Kokomi recently because... I've completely changed her artifact set. So I'm sure that you are aware that during the 2.6 update, we had a new artifact set called Ocean Hued Clam. Now, I was able to grind on the new domain in Serai Island uh, to get some of these artifacts. Now, what is so good about this artifact set is that it allows Kokomi to do more damage when she is in battle. So basically what happens is, actually what we'll do is I'll just read out what it says because there's a quite a lot of information about this four piece set. So basically what it says is when a character equips this set, there's like a, well, it's like a bubble that appears when you use your elemental skill. They call it a seed dyed foam here and it'll appear, it'll appear for three seconds. Now when it, disappears it basically just explodes and it deals damage so this is one way of allowing kokomi to do like damage when she's out on the field or either when she's off the field or out of it so this is what will happen so if i do my elemental skill right here you see there's like a little bubble that appears right next to her and it just explodes now what happens is when that explodes it deals damage but you have to be inside the area of healing to equip it if you put it on someone like Barbara and you use her elemental skill with Barbara because of the fact that she, the the healing goes along with you when you're running it will just appear while the elemental skill is in play so yeah I, I guess you can sort of like you can use it on Barbara you can use it on I don't know can you use it on Xingqiu because he's like more of a support character in the game but yeah what I'll do is I'll go back to my uh, character setting right here. So, yeah, I've, I've been using this on Kokomi, and it's actually really cool. She's able to do a bit more damage now, um, and uh, some of the artifacts as well. Um, I've had to sacrifice a lot of crit rate uh, to allow me to get this this artifact. What I lack in crit rate, Kokomi kind of makes up for it in the seed dyed foam because it actually deals a lot of damage. Also, her HP is like just under thirty thousand, so. Dude, Kokomi for me is like an actual tank. Like a, like a support tank. She's like Mercy, but with lots of... Like a hell of a lot of HP. Instead of just like 200. Anyway, with that said... Let's go and talk about the events. Because we need to talk about that real quick. So, obviously you're very aware of this new um, event. Coming with the 2.6 update. It's called Shadows Amid Snowstorms. I've been able to play through the first part of the story... It's pretty interesting. I'm not going to reveal all of it because, you know, spoilers. But there's some really interesting information about Albedo that uh, we didn't know previously about him. Um, and yeah, it's kind of crucial for the part of the storyline. I'm not going to reveal everything because, you know, spoilers. Um, but uh, yeah, we got these... Um, I mean, you know how these, these events work. They just give you like these very small tidbits of content that you can do over the course of like... What we're looking at two weeks um and then you got the event shop which you can use to buy all of your stuff i haven't bought all this stuff yet i've been focusing solely on hero's wit because i wanted to uh, there were a couple of characters that i wanted to level up one of them being uh yan fei uh the other one being diluc and also what was his name what was her name chi chi honestly i don't know why i'm leveling up chi chi she's terrible in this game apparently uh but then later on you get the trial trophies um, which I believe comes along with the second part of the story. I think. Yeah. But yeah, but, but so far we just get this. We just got this. Uh, we also, we get a chance to build our own snowman as well. Yes, we, we, we know Kokomi. Yeah, we got, we got all this stuff to do. So building snowmen. Rather fun, right? I mean, cooler diamonds, wet dream. Um, and then we got, uh... Yes, we know Kokomi, we know. We've said it about 100 times. Anyway, <laughs> we've also got this, which is what we're going to be doing, by the way, in this in this video. So, uh, 
Yeah, we've got all this uh, tracker training. So basically what it is, is you've got this, which is like an obstacle course. you just got like this running obstacle thing. And this one here, you've got to go around a certain area and melt a bunch of ice cubes to um, pick up some stuff for your snowmen. And then this part, I think, is like, it's basically what it is, it's like you, you turn this thing on and then a bunch of enemies come out. And then you've got to defeat them. And then it just sort of does something. I don't know. I haven't done that part of the... <laughs> There's a lot of things I haven't done in this yet. I've been doing this gradually just to prevent myself from doing everything so quickly to a point where I just uh, run out of things to do. So, I don't know. What should we do? Should we just do... Just for a bit of gameplay. Should we just do this? Yeah, let's just do this. Let's go to the challenge. Let's just do this for a bit of gameplay, you know? Yeah, I know there's no there's no uh, face cam for this. By the way, you know, I just want to do. I just want to get some content out for you guys, for YouTube and everything. All right, so we'll do this. Why not? Right, so I'm going to go with this team uh, because you need pyro characters. I don't know why I've got three pyro characters. I don't know. I just, I just literally just chose these characters on a whim. So yeah, Kaching, obviously, big Kaching main. I am right. So let's go ahead and deploy this, and uh, let's get started. So basically. We gotta go over to, the, to this area. Oh god, let's not. Uh... Oh no, we don't. We don't want to. We don't want to go anywhere near that Fatui guy. Okay, so these 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 ice cubes here. All you gotta do is melt them, and then you grab a bunch of snowmen stuff that you can use for your snowman, which is cool. Um, yeah, lovely content. Oh goodness me, we got some killer shells here. Goodbye. This might take a while, guys. <laughs> I, I don't ever use Yanfei. Like, I never use her a lot, any, ever. But, um... Is that a new, is that a new voice line for uh, Bennett there? I don't know. Right. Done. So, we got, we got uh, six more ice cubes to melt. Which we'll go ahead and do. Right. That's another hat for the snowman. Oh god, it's a boar. Have I killed it? Yeah, chilled me. Oh yeah, we need to go ahead and warm ourselves up because, you know, sheer cold and everything. Oh, screw it. Let's get one of these. Oh no. This is bad. Oh Christ, let's get one of these then. Oh wait, we can go down here, can't we? Great gameplay content. Right, let's light this up. Okay. Alright, so we'll just go ahead and uh, light this up. Oh god, there's a, there's a cryo... Um, Sissin Mage over there. Okay, let's just uh, climb this. Right, let's go and uh, get rid of all the rest of these. Uh, these. Co oh, go away! Okay, I'll melt the ice cube behind you, but yeah. Can we please not. Uh... <laughs> go away! Go on, go on, Bennett, finish him off. There we go. Overload. Always good. Oh no, there's. A oh my days, there's a lower chill. Okay. Um, right. Can we melt that? Okay, I really don't want to face that thing with the team I've got now. <laughs> uh, actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go to my party setup real quick. Sorry, Yanfei, but a uh, bit surplus to requirements in this situation. Okay, we'll go with... We'll go official. And then we'll go with ka -ching. Should we go with that? Yeah, we'll go with that. And then what we'll do is we'll go with the inventory here. And then, if, if, in the event of a possible meeting with the Laura Chill, you've got to be prepared for this, guys. Um, and then we're going to go with... Come on, hurry up, damn it! Oh, my goodness. Um, where, where's my food buffs? Where are my food buffs, damn it? Oh, Christ, I have one of them. Right, this is in the event of that pop thing possibly going for a... picking a fight. Right. Oh, I guess we don't need to, then. Okay. And there you go, challenge completed. <laughs> Gaming content at its finest. You gotta love it. All right, so now that we've got that finished, uh, we can go to Dragon Spine Special Training, pick up our rewards. Hold on. Where? Are, give me my rewards. 
Right, so that's completed now. So we can go ahead and claim those. Good job. 30 PGs in the bank. Let's go. Uh, and then we can go to the event shop. What can we buy from here? I, I would like to buy some of these because you need these for the um, the Cinnabar Spindle. The, the weapon that you pick up when you um, make your first snowman. So when you make your first snowman, you pick up the uh, the, Cinnabar, the Cinnabar Spindle, which is like the, the, the four-star weapon you can get for free. And then when you have enough of these um, coins, you can pick up these, which are able to enhance your weapon. So, yeah, you've got, lo you got loads of these to pick up as well. So what I need... Actually, we'll go, we'll go and buy some, some MEOs. Why not? Uh, we'll buy about about 25 of them. Yeah, why not? Yeah, I mean this is this is something you can just do while the I mean you still got like two weeks to do this. I mean it's not like you're gonna run out of days to do it. But yeah, this is pretty what pretty much what this is. You've also got the um, the hangout events with uh, Goro and Beidou. So I'll be doing those at some point. Uh, and of course this is this is the new boss that you can you can meet. I believe in Surumi Island. I think this is either in Surumi Island or Serai. I think it might be in Surumi, yeah. Surumi, Surumi Island. It's a Geo boss, so you're going to need to bring some Geo characters with you if you're going to beat this thing. So yeah, you get uh, you get some rewards as well. You got loads of Geo gems as well. You got this, which is a, a Riftborn Regalia. That's that's probably some level up material that you're going to need for certain characters. Maybe Goro. If Go I think I think if Goro comes out, I think this is what you're going to need to get to level him up. Um, and then you've got these. I, I wish they I, w I wish they would change these. Like these are the standard um, artifacts that you pick up. So it's it's Wanderer's Troop and Gladiator's Finale. I wish they could. I wish they could. I wish they could variate these a bit. Because these are like little. These these are like really boring to pick up. But these are really, really good to pick up if you want to level up some of your other artifacts for other characters. So it doesn't really make, it really makes sense in that department anyway. But yeah, this is the 2.6 update. Uh, Shadows Amid Snowstorms. There's also another one coming out as well with um, the new character Arataki Ito. Uh, which is the Nick. I think he's the new G I think he's the new Geo Claymore user from uh, Inazuma who's going to be coming after the uh, after these things. So if I go to my wish wishes you've got uh you got you got uh, albedo on one and you got eula on the other one this is the new thing as well uh is now they are um they're bringing out two five stars um to roll for i'm not going to by the way because i've got 7800 prima gems and five intertwined fate i am literally saving up for a ganyu banner that's the reason why I've got so many Prima Gems. I've already got I've already got Eula, so this is an easy miss for me. And so honestly, I don't really give a fuck about Albedo. <laughs> really, I don't. I mean, if you're a big Albedo fan, then yeah, this would probably be for you, but I'm I'm not going for Albedo. I am literally waiting for Garnu's banner to come out so I can literally splurge like a mad boss. So, mad boss, like a bad boy, I should say. But yeah, this is pretty much it, really. This is like the 2.6 update. I'm going to do a video at some point. I don't know when, but I will be doing a video. Um, now, I'm, I'm not a Genshin Impact content creator. I'm mostly an Overwatch content creator. I focus my content on Overwatch. So Genshin Impact is more like a, a game that I go to that is more of a, a chill out game that I can do off camera more than something I can do content for. But I will do a video at some point talking to you about how I feel about this game after playing it for a year because there's something about it that I want to say that you know a lot of people say about content not being enough of it and yeah I will talk about it in great depth in, in another video but yeah anyway for now thank you very much for watching this very very pointless filler content -y video for Genshin Impact if you enjoyed it and you want to see more like this in the future, then go ahead and click on the subscribe button, send a comment, like the video, and then turn on your notifications. It really does help me out a great deal. Also, you can check me out on my social medias, my Twitter account, and my Discord server will all be in the description down below. Thank you very much for stopping by, chaps. Have a great day. Have a great life. Be nice to your fellow gamers because we are all human beings. I've been ZMG, and until the next video, I shall see you later. Peace.